Greco, he knows. Baba, he is my savior. I will follow where he goes. Jesus loves me, finds me, cares for me, watches, saves. Baba, really, she went the sun is hot. You don't need that woolly coat, surely not. But in the winter when the snow is here you will grow another one so don't cry dear what's up are these said old young people how are you too deep did you see do you see my friends look i'm like a shepherd today i've got sheep sheep everywhere everywhere and i wonder if you can spot the tiny one mm, that'll be interesting to see if you can find it but anyway good to see you give fiona a big high five Give it a wave. How's your week been? Has it been good or has it been not so good? Are you tired this week? We're awfully tired this week. Don't know, I think I must be working too hard. I think I might just need to take the day off. What do you think? I think you need to give Fiona a big high five to say take the day off. And if not, then I'm just going to have to work. Keep working until I see you all. But anyway, do you like my sheep? It's to do with a story. It's to do with a story. But before, before we talk about it, I'm going to put this one down at my feet because I wonder how good you are at movies. Mm. So here we go. I'm going to test your memory, right? And what we're going to do is instead of putting your hand up to tell me that you know this, what I want you to shout out is to, I want you to go, bah! As if you're a sheep, right? As if you're a sheep today, right? So let's hear you. Let's practice. Go ba. Oh wow! Well done. Well done. Good sounding of sheep. But anyway, if I were to say to infinity and beyond, I wonder which character that would be. So what was that? Oh, I can't hear the bars. <gasps> Right, okay, so to infinity and beyond. And the person, the person who said that was Ta da Buzz Lightyear to infinity and beyond. Well done, well done. So I'm gonna put him down here. Okay, now the next one. Oh the next one. Are we ready? If I were to see some people are melting to see me. I wonder who it could be. Do you know? You're right. It is. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? It is Olaf. Oh, out of Frozen. And it's not too cold today, so we're glad of that, isn't it? So this is Olaf. So put this one down. All right, my next one. If you know this, remember to shout out bah as if you're a sheep, okay? This phrase, this person or this creature said, keep on, keep on swimming, keep on swimming, just keep swimming. Mm. I wonder who it could be. What do you think? Oh, I wonder if you've seen this movie. This is... Dory, Dory just keeps on swimming. That's all she does is swim, 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 swim. So that's Dory. Okay. Oh, this is one of my favourites. This is one of my favourites. And I wonder, I wonder if you can tell me who says, Me want cookie. Me want cookie. Who do you think it is? You're right. You're right. It's the... Cookie Monster. Oh, yummy, yummy. Need to have lots of cookies today because it's Sunday, okay? And there's no calories in God's food, so you can have as many cookies as you like. Okay, now, I wonder, I wonder if you know this one. I wonder who says this. Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Even though the sound of it is something quite atrocious. I wonder who says that. Can I hear? Can you shout it out? <gasps> well done. Well done. It is. 
Mary Poppins. Yeah, well done. So I'm going to put this one down here and Adam can have a wee look at them later and let you see them all. Now, I wonder what you've been thinking about all these images because if you hadn't seen Dory, if you hadn't seen Dory before, you wouldn't know that she swam all around. And if you didn't, and if you've watched Buzz Lightyear, you would know immediately that Buzz Lightyear's phrase is to infinity and beyond. And that's because we've got to know these characters in our movies. And we, and we spend a lot of time watching it and remembering and recognising the voice and the phrase. But I wonder, I wonder if you could tell me who says, who says this phrase? Love each other as I have loved you. I wonder, I wonder who that could be. Who do you think it is? Hmm? Will I show you? Will I show you? It is... Jesus. Jesus says that love each other as I have loved you. And sometimes he's known as the good shepherd because a shepherd cares for his sheep. And that's why I've got sheep today because we're thinking about the good shepherd. But one of the things I want you to remember boys and girls is that when we start to read our Bibles and we pray to Jesus and we talk about Jesus, we'll recognise who Jesus is because we have heard him speak to us through his words. When he says, love each other as I have loved you, we know that Jesus is there and Jesus is the one who's telling us that he loves us very much and that he loves all our family. So never forget that, boys and girls. Never forget that Jesus loves you so much, so much, that he cares for all of us. And that's including all our family and all our sheep. If you've got sheep in the house, maybe bring them out today as well. You're eating all your cookies. You just never know. You could have a, a sheep picnic. What do you think? Okay, boys and girls, I'm going to put Jesus down just now. And I'm going to put him there. I'm going to leave him there so you can everybody can see him. And my big sheep here can, look, can watch after him. Boys and girls, what I want you to do now is I want you to go and get your Bibles if you've got one. And I want you to look up John chapter 10. And I want you to look at verse 4. And this is in my Bible here. And it says, uh, verse 3 and 4, sorry. And it says, the man who guards the door opens it for him. And the sheep listen to his voice. Of the shepherd. The shepherd calls his own sheep using their names and he leads them out and he brings all of his sheep out. Then he goes ahead of them and leads them. They follow him because they know his voice. Boys and girls, Jesus knows our voice. He knows who we are and if, and if we get lost or we're afraid or we're a bit scared, we can always turn to our parents and we can always pray to God. But I'm hoping what we're going to do is we're going to look at a little video and it talks about Jesus as the Good Shepherd. And then once we've done that, then we're going to come back and make our offering. Okay? So get your cushions and get comfortable as we watch this little clip about Jesus the Good Shepherd.
Boys and girls, we're going to make an offering now, okay? So you know the rules. Are we ready? You're going to pause me, but remember, always to come back. You ready? Three, two, one, pause. Oh, boys and girls, good to have you all back there, and thank you for unpausing me. I thought I was going to have to hold my collection bowl like that until you came back, but it's good to have you back. So let's make get our pennies and let's put them in our tin or our jar and let's keep them and we'll bring it back to church when we're able to get back after this lockdown. And I hope you're, you're doing okay during that lockdown because it is quite hard going, isn't it? Having to look after your parents all the time because they're always there, aren't they? Which is a great thing. But anyway, let's close our eyes and let's talk to God in prayer. Now, grown-ups, remember, close your eyes, close your eyes. Because the young ones, they're super at this. They are so good at praying to God. So let's talk to God for a wee moment. Let's pray together. Dear God, thank you for looking after us and for caring about us and loving us so much. And we know your voice. We know what you tell us to do because when we read the scriptures, when we read our Bibles, we hear your words. And we thank you that as a shepherd, as that good shepherd, that you look after everyone. So Lord, wherever we are, look after our friends and our families and continue to let us know how much you love us. And as the days get warmer and the sun is out longer, let's look for the beauty in the gardens and the trees and the blue skies and all the creatures that we can see for they are a reminder of who you are so lord until we meet again keep us safe keep us well and keep us connected with each other and with you so lord hear our prayers amen so boys and girls let me just go put this up here Okay, okay. Now, it's time for me to go because I'm going to have to take this, these sheep out for a walk because if I don't, they're going to make a mess in my carpet and I don't want that because I'll get into trouble. And I think they're needing a wee bit of walk outside, a wee bit of fresh air. And I hope you've been getting some walks and, and, and having some time outside in a fresh air. Maybe in your paddling pools or maybe playing in your sand pits. Or even make it walking your new dogs or your puppies that you've seemingly St Mitchell and, and Boyd have got. And I, you need to tell us what the name of your wee puppies is. Um, and, and anyone else who's got dogs or pets that you need to look after. Alright? So boys and girls, until we meet each other once again, I'll speak to you soon. Shepherd everywhere I go, he knows. Baba, he is my savior, I will follow where he goes. Jesus loves me, finds me, cares for me, watches, saves me, leads back home. Baba, he's the good shepherd. Where he goes, I will follow where he.
goes. 